close uh, the, the boat, eh? and see what is happening, man. Oh, yeah. I'm going to see whether I can reach the boat. Wow. What is it? What is it? He's opening your mama. <laughs> this is a Uganda reference village, uh, Uganda the part of Africa. Just come and visit and enjoy. And see what is happening. Let's go to the water and see what I can do. Yeah. ちゃんもらんてやまじまんぴ。まんぴえ。え、かちあお、おぼやがらげなむがりあま、あげり、え、わ、わら。おこいさりバンス、おばえんかし。どこでわだんこかすぐえ。とんがかもうでんが。え、
the bird watching. These are all found at the Uganda Reptile Village, that is Unono and Tebe Road. Just go to their website and on the Facebook pages, social medias, then you book yourself a slot to come and visit this place. Uganda is the part of Africa, we're almost to the lake. Wow. So uh, we've come to see the tortoise. Let me enter and see what is happening here. Exactly. Oh wow, it's just good. It's so good. So it's in India. Wow. Eh, man. That is it one new. So what is the name of this exactly? Um, this is the one which is well known as the leopard tortoise. Leopard tortoise. Yes. Some presses they call it grazer. Grazer. Yes. Okay, I'm, I'm seeing it. So how how harmful is it? It is not. Some people tend to tell us that they have poisons also. Mm, those are just a myth. Now, what is the age of this? It is estimated to be in a 60, 75 years. Okay. Wow, I can see it's just nice. Uh, so that is... Okay. So, um, this one is still a juvenile because the one which is fully grown, mm. that is the time when it can be 80 centimeters from the ground. That is the time uh, when you can even uh, get a chance of sitting on it and enjoy a free ride. Hey, yeah. after it goes growing up. Yes, here you can see. I don't know whether my cameraman can climb to. Should I send it to you? Come on, go to the water. Why do you go to the water? Can you take a good look at the water? <laughs> so, um, wow, so it's it's a actually. vegetarian mm. in nature. Okay. Yeah, they eat fruits mm. and grass. Fruits and grass? Yeah, so basically they are found in the semi desert areas. Yeah, that's where I picked it from. Yeah. So, um, the reason why it is called the leopard tortoise is because it has a same design like a, a leopard. Yes, a leopard. So it has less enemies because of its shell. Mm. So if it, those animals try to attack it, they just put everything inside. Oh, it just hides it? Yes. Like, let me try it. A time because this one is a bit used to environment. Hey, so it, it really hurts it? Yeah. So how strong is this thing? Um, Can I break it if I decide to beat? Uh, that is actually one of the ways the way how we get the this uh tortoise is because people try to prove whether the share is very hard and then they could bring a panger and try to cut to prove whether the share is very hard but okay. what i can tell the share is hard according to the size of the of the certain uh tortoise and the, the weight and the edge yes given the machine you're using to beat it yes exactly so uh that is what i can tell okay so you said these small ones? Uh, these are the ones which are well known as the bells hing, and these are the ones which are commonly seen here in the center of Uganda. They were small ones, eh? Yes. Okay. Because of the reason why they are called bells hing is because of this hing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So if something like a scare them, they put everything here Inside. and they use this hinge mm. like to rock this okay. down apart. Hey. Yes. Yeah, Garida on the rocking. Yeah, Garida near rocking and the mass near rocking. This is nature. We are talking about nature these days. This part of Africa, we are powered by beaver organic. Uh, we are powered by beaver organic. You can see uh, from Access Building. Thank you so much for the great work you're doing to support us and supporting nature. Beaver organic for your health matters. Just visit them. Their number is on the screen. And uh, we are having uh, my fellows to work with. First media Uganda. At the same time, also on my YouTube channel. We are trying to explore Uganda. I call upon all the people in this world, just come and visit Uganda, the part of Africa. I remember it was Churchill who talked about it. No. Churchill, it's called Churchill. Yeah. Winston. Yeah. He's the one who said that Uganda is the part of Africa. Yes. yes depending yes. according to what I'm seeing here. So we are going to see the Naolo. Yes, the chameleons. See the chameleons. Okay. The Naolo. Yeah. Let me put these ones down. Eh? Wow. These are the tortoise. <laughs> they match it. <laughs> the one food. They were one food. Mm. Very heavy. <laughs> now we are. Should I put here? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Bring them close to me. Sure. When you look at their head, it's like a real snake. Yes. So when you hold them, mm. and at times they can scratch you with the sharp nails. Mm. Yeah. So that you can put them down. Mm. Or they can produce a bad smell. Okay. Yeah. 
Mm. So uh, this one, they are commonly seen in a rainy time. Okay. And they, uh, when it is like a dry season, they normally dig down mm. the trenches and hide there. Okay. So uh, they, are, they are very shy. They don't like to be in an open place. So they can hold their breath underwater mm. for over 30 minutes. Okay. Of this type, there are over 24 of them. Here? Mm, of the, this type. Okay, the type. Yeah. Family, yes. Mm. Over. You say that this po is, is it poisonous? No, they are not. They just bite, eh? Yeah, they just bite. Can I touch they it? They can chop off your finger. Hey. Keep your finger. Yeah. Yeah. Emma. Huh? They've said it they bite. can chop they your can finger. They can chop my finger. If you can start choking, then they can't. You say they can chop my finger? Yeah, if you're careless. If I'm careless? Yeah. This guy, they can bite. Mm. Yes. Thinking that they are protecting themselves. Okay. So, what is the age of this? Expected to be in seven, ten years. Seven, ten years. Seven to ten years. Somebody don't tell us that they eat these things. Are they edible? Yeah. In uh, because you know here in our country we have over fifty-two tribes. Okay. Some people they eat them. Oh. Others they don't. Okay. But for me as a person who conserving. What is it doing? You do nothing for it me. It is scared. Mm. It is now trying to. That is one of the signs that this animal is scared. Hey, because one. one we have dropped it down. Yes. Okay. So it this is, is the fun we always enjoy at some of these places, eh? We just travel with Emma. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And it's what? Um I was saying that it is very common in reptiles. Mm. When they get scared, okay. Time they so mm. time they can cook. Wow. We're having Lutaya has been our teach of the day, the guide telling us about this. We are probably powered by Beef Organic Access Building. They always make this happen. Yeah. Let me put it back. Yeah. Oh, it's back. 